Hey everybody, it's Adam here. It's March 9th. Uh, you are tuning in to One Man's Perspective. Just want to talk a little bit today about uh, the Zlatan Ibrahimovic versus LeBron James uh, heated arguments over Twitter over the last uh, couple weeks. Uh, essentially, uh, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, who's not known for uh, being quiet about things since he's one of the most obnoxiously loud players in the history of the game, um, and also one of the most blatantly arrogant, um, has basically said uh, to LeBron James, you know, like, I appreciate you as a player, but you should probably stop talking about things, uh, you know, um, about social activism, essentially, because, you know, athletes are just athletes. LeBron clapped back and was like, well, Zlatan, I appreciate you as a player, but I'm going to talk about whatever I want to talk about, you know. And honestly, you know, using my platform for good is what is going to ha- is what is going to continue to happen. Personally, I side on the LeBron, on the LeBron James uh, perspective. I mean, I love Zlatan Ibrahimovic. The man is an idol, is a god, you know, in sport. I mean, he really is an incredible player. But honestly, he just needs to shut the fuck up about it. Uh, I think honestly, you know, like the stature of players, you know, gives them the platform to be able to speak out on things about social justice and issues that essentially affect them or their communities, which is exactly what LeBron James has done for many, many years. I think he should continue to do it. I think the stature allows him to have that platform um, to essentially affect change in his community, as he's done with his uh, the schools that he's opened, you know, in, uh, in Akron and other uh, parts of um, Ohio, where he essentially is helping lower income families have greater opportunity through access to better education. So for me, uh, Zlatan, I mean, yeah, I'd love to see some of the humanitarian work that you do. I personally haven't heard much about it, so uh, maybe you should uh, back up your claims of, you know, um, being an incredible person and being a lion like you talk about so frequently, you know, and basically just say, hey, maybe it's time to back that up, you know, and actually do some humanitarian work because I haven't actually heard you do a whole lot. I mean, yeah, I hear you, you know, do some work with kids here and there, and that's great. Kudos to you. So does LeBron James. He has a lot more than that. This is Adam. It's One Man's Perspective. Thanks.